Here's how to haul motorcycles in a van. You can see I've built my own loading ramp and I bought these uh, extenders that go on the front of it. So this is just some two by tens with some uh, metal extenders on them. And then if you take the seats out of the van, you can use the seat mounting points as tie downs. They're strong enough to hold the motorcycle down. And the idea is have forces pulling it this way, pulling it this way, have the bike in gear so the back wheel doesn't roll, and then on the front side, if your bike is tall, what I've done is used a strap to kind of pull the forks down so to make the bike shorter because this bike is too tall to fit in the van otherwise. And of course I've removed the mirrors on this one which has mirrors. Now on the smaller dirt bike, I use this fork brace in here to keep the front suspension from moving up and down when I strap it down and that makes it strap more securely. And then again, I've got straps going on one side, pulling it down. And then on the other side, pulling it down the other way. The idea being you pull the wheel down so that it can't roll and with the back wheel locked into gear and then on the, on the front brake, I'll take a strap and wrap it around the front brake lever or a bungee cord like I did on this one to hold the front brake lock to keep it from sliding forward and you can see it's a strappy mess. I've seen people do it with just a couple of straps per bike but I like to put more in there just in case I get in an accident to keep the bikes from dancing around. Um, the only trouble with hauling two bikes this way is there aren't any mounting locations towards the outside of the van. So if you wanted to do it perfect, you'd probably want to drill some holes in the floor where people aren't going to step on them and then put an eye bolt in there. So that's it. It is possible to haul two motorcycles in a GMC Safari or Astro van.